sun is the center of our solar system as a giant ball of plasma. It's pretty hard to miss him in its 30 million degree century. You would see how to use your helium and release energy. Magnetic fields of solar flares and coronal mass ejections at particles from these first temperature electronic conventions. It's 100 times wider than Venus and Mars bar. In spite of all of this, it's just an average sized star. Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars are the first four planets rocky like ours. Jupiter, Saturn, Mars, and Neptune are made of hydrogen and helium gas like a balloon. Mercury is the closest planet to the sun, and as such, it takes the least time to run around its orbit. Its year is only 88 Earth days, and the solar wind means that little gas stays on a trucky surface, barren and full of craters. With no atmosphere, its temperature wavers from 800 Fahrenheit to minus 309, but the mist is ice in craters away from the light. Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars are the first four planets rocky like ours. Jupiter, Saturn, Mars, Venus is the second planet from the sun, it's the same size as Earth, give or take some. Venus is covered in a thick layer of clouds made of carbon dioxide, which in effect shrouds the planet from losing heat like a giant blanket, so it's 90 degrees due to the greenhouse effect. It's covered with volcanoes and a ship by their powers, and the only folks that ever landed died within two hours. Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars are the first four planets rocky like ours, Jupiter, Saturn, Mars, Earth is the third planet from the sun. I got a feeling you're familiar with this one. It's the only planet known to have had life in its history. Though just how life started is still a bit of a mystery. Four billion years ago, two protoplanets collided, and our moon was formed when collision debris united Earth in the Goldilocks zone. Not too hot nor too cold for liquid water to exist in life as we know it to take hold. Mercury, Venus, Earth, and Mars are the first four planets rocky like ours. Jupiter, Saturn, Mars, and Mars is the fourth planet from the sun, and it's the place for our voyage to other planets has begun. The surface is covered with red iron oxide, and once the atmosphere is blown away with no magnetic field inside, the astronomers saw canals everywhere, and they thought perhaps aliens had put them there. Thanks to telescopes, orbiters, and rovers, we now know that there are no such alien canals, although rivers, boats, volcanoes, and canyons abound. There's a little water left from life on Mars, still be found, so they see they scrap there. Try and understand Mars' geologic history. Between the inner planets and outer planets, there are fields of asteroids orbiting in a belt around our star. Sometimes they are knocked out of their stable orbit, and if you might collide with Earth, if they don't avoid it, why the belt? Well, it has to do with Jupiter, you see. It pulls on the belt with its massive gravity, preventing asteroids from forming into another planet. But don't worry, a big one can't hit Earth soon, can it?